Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome into ForTheLow.net, the best place on the planet to buy discontinued electronics. My name is Spencer and today I've got a, a Philips DVD recorder to show you. It'll make it really convenient for saving your favorite TV shows. You can just record them right off the air or you can even record from any device onto it. And something that's really nice about this one is it's got HDMI 1080p up conversion. So basically that means you've got the best playback quality possible for your DVDs, but let's go ahead and talk about it. All right, so on the rear panel of it, you have your video input right here for recording and S video for recording as well. And then you have composite video output and audio output for standard playback. And then you've got component output, which is a little bit better than the composite right here. And then you've got S video and then HDMI, which will be your best option. And then coaxial digital audio. And this was manufactured in March of 2007 and it was made in China. And the model number of it is DVD-R3475. And then to get it connected, you'll probably want to use the HDMI, but you can also use the red, white, and yellow hookup. Just connect it to the video output. All right, and then once you have it all connected, you can go ahead and power it on. And you can go ahead and insert a DVD. So we'll just put in a standard DVD to show the playback. And on the front panel, there isn't too much going on. You've got a power button, eject button, play, stop, and record buttons. And then if you open this door right here, you have a S video input, composite input, and audio input, as well as a DV input. All of those are for recording. And the DV input will make it easy for you to connect a camera to it if you want to transfer from a camera. So looks like the DVD loaded. And this is the original remote control for it. You've got a bunch of different options on it. You've got rapid play, skip, timer. With the timer option, you can set timed recording so that they automatically begin recording as long as you have a DVD in there. That's good for if you're not around when your show comes on. And then this is the setup menu. So we're going to go ahead and record. We're going to transfer from a VHS onto a blank disc. So. We'll just hook this VCR up to it. And we'll use a red, white, and yellow cable. You can hook this up to the rear of the DVD recorder or the front, and then hook up the other end to the output on the VCR. Next thing we'll do is we'll put in a blank disc. You can use minus or plus Rs for this or you can, you can use DVD minus or plus R or RW. And with the minus or plus R discs, those are record once, which is what we're gonna use. Or you can use RW, which you can record multiple times on. That's good for if you're planning on deleting what you recorded. But loaded the disc. So now we can go ahead and put a VHS in here and then make sure that the input on the DVD recorder is set to the correct one. So we'll go we'll press the source button. So now you're watching the, the VCR and uh, any moment you can just push record and it'll start recording. Is he captive like Smee and Nicholas Nickleby? So we'll just let it record for a minute and once we're done recording we can hit stop or we can wait until the disc has maxed out its capacity which is two hours of standard playback 
And once you are done recording though, you wanna make sure you finalize it as long as you plan on playing it in other DVD players. Once you've recorded what you want to record, you can hit the stop button and then it will save the recording to the disc and it also reminds you right there, make sure you finalize it, otherwise you won't be able to play it. So now, if you wanted to, you would be able to play back that DVD. But in order to make sure it works in other DVD players, we will hit the stop button. And then we will go to setup. And then disk edit. And then finalize. So now we'll just give it a moment while it finalizes. There is for this Philips DVD recorder. You can record cable television or you can transfer from another device onto a DVD if you wanted to. But if you're looking to order one of these, you can get it on our online store at forthelow.net or you can give us a call.